Hey y'all, Irix Sky here, back again from the Appalachian Ocean. And I wanted to respond to a question actually from several viewers in what is the best drone for beginners? Well, I've got the best drone, what I feel, and this is the year 2024, what I feel is the best drone for beginners right here in my paws. And by the way, you can expand this video's description and click the link there to find both the case and the drone and also a bunch of accessories if you if you feel like you need them what's amazing about this drone and why i feel it's the best drone for beginners and if you haven't subscribed to my channel be sure to do so and watch all my drone videos i started with dji phantom one many years ago i've got dji phantom one videos and all the other drones videos too so just subscribe to my channel and check out those drone videos but this is extremely small extremely lightweight it comes with prop guards already attached so it makes it a safer drone one thing it does not have is obstacle avoidance but even the drones that do that's not something that people should assume should assume rather exists to be safe and responsible so the absence of obstacle avoidance is not an issue in my in my book but you get prop guards you get a camera that can do 4k you can also record in 1080 and you know lesser resolutions if you choose to do so. This drone is USB-C rechargeable, so you just stick it in, charge it up. That USB-C port, if you use a Mac computer like I do to edit videos, you can stick it in, power on the drone, and you can uh, directly import your videos into Final Cut Pro 10 or whatever you use to edit your videos. Super nice. This drone does not have a micro SD card slot, so you don't have to wonder, oh, did I forget to bring my micro SD card? It's got, I think it's 25 gigs of storage. Check the link within this video's description to see the exact size, but I think it's 25 gigs. More than enough space to capture an abundance of videos while you're in the field. Um, the, uh, the battery, excellent battery life, by the way, but it's easy to pop off and pop on it'll be super easy especially in a case like mine to carry extra batteries if you wanted to but the best part about dji neo especially for beginners is that all you have to buy is the drone you don't have to buy a controller you can you can add a controller if you choose to do so but you can fly this with your phone using the dji app uh, dji fly app subscribe check out my dji neo's videos playlist and you can see you can see that in action but the camera guard comes with it easy on easy off better protects the camera while it's not in use you can fly this drone without the app it's got a little built-in uh it's got some built-in flight mode so i mean it's it's an extremely robust drone now why is it the best for beginners well and like i said i've been flying drones since dji phantom one the flight dynamics of this how you control it going sideways going up and down going forward going backwards sending the camera down tilting the camera down tilting the camera up this behaves the same way as most any of the other dji drones so as a beginner this may be all that you ever need. You may be like, well, this is so awesome. I get 4K video. It's a great drone. It is. You may not want to upgrade. But if you ever needed or wanted a larger and even more capable DJI drone, learning with this DJI Neo, it would be a natural progression. I mean, when you picked up, if you did, if you decided to buy a larger DJI drone, flying it would feel the same as this. You would just have something that's bigger and more capable if you've got a little bit of wind. This can handle wind well, but obviously due to the ultralight size, uh, to the ultralight weight and the tiny size, it wouldn't handle wind as well as the physically larger DJI drones. So, you know, something to be aware of, but this thing is the best drone for beginners in my opinion. Like I said, I'm filming this video during October of 2024 so if you're shopping for the dji neo you just want the basic kit like i've got comes with a battery 
you know, it comes with a little charging cable and the you know I think it comes with an extra propeller or two it's already got the prop guard zone expand this video's description and click the link there but if you if you want to add a controller you can buy a controller for it I've linked the controller within this video's description also extra batteries so it's easy to buy just the drone and have an amazing time but if you want to add accessories controller batteries carry in case all of that you can but just with the drone itself and your smartphone or even without your smartphone by using this little button here with the intelligent flight modes it's easy to have a good time with uh with a drone and like i said this behaves just like the other dji drone so it's a great drone for beginners because it trains and then you know you take it wherever you want to take it and this may be the only drone you ever need or ever want but it's uh it's also less expensive than a lot of the other drones so if if you're a beginner and you know you lose it or you sit on it or whatever and it breaks it's less of a loss from a financial perspective so that's another value add for this being the best drone in my opinion for beginners like always i remind everyone i am the drone evangelist always practice and preach safe and responsible drone use i encourage all of y'all to be fellow drone evangelists always practice and preach safe and responsible drone use because if we don't do that this hobby that we all love or maybe you're exploring and that's why you're looking for the best drone for beginners if we don't practice and preach safe and responsible drone use this hobby may cease to exist and that would be catastrophic thanks for your viewership be sure to subscribe ring that bell when you do to be notified whenever i post another video and check out all my drone videos. I've got thousands of drone videos now and thousands more coming soon. Y'all have a good day. Hey y'all, I Rick Sky here. I hope you enjoyed this video and please be sure to subscribe to my channel and when you do, ring that bell icon to be notified whenever I post another video. Thanks for your viewership and y'all have a good day.